Hello, so in this video, I will tell you how you can add the mark record in your cPanel. So, according to the Google latest policy, you will have to add the mark record in your DNS that will help you to improve deliverability of your emails. So, here you can see as we scroll down, you have some filters like you can add none, so all the emails will be coming to the inbox and quarantine for the spammy folder, and you can also reject the emails. So this is now a, a must by the Google. So if you do not add it, so you can face any consequences. As we set up the SMTP here in the last video, but you can see it also says that the deliverability should be improved and the mark action required. So now you have to add the mark record. You can add the demark record from your domain registrar, but as some people update their name servers, if you have updated your name servers then you will have to use cpanel for that so here i am in my web hosting and i will go to cpanel so i have, i have already created video to add the demark record in domain registrar so this one is for the cpanel process so here for to add the demark record you will have to search zone editor so you can go to zone editor and here you will have to go to manage on the domain where you want to add the demark record so this is my own domain where i have created my own personal portfolio website and i have listed my services and products so here we will have to click on this arrow button and we will click on add demark record so here you can see it has already added the host name for us so if we go to this article by google here you can see so we will have to add this thing in the host name that the cpanel has already done for us so if they do not do this for you then you can just write underscore demark dot and then you can write your domain name and once this is done then you can copy this thing v equal to demark1 p equal to none so you can copy it and you can go to zone editor so here you don't have to make any change you can just click on save record so when we were doing the change in the domain registrar there does not do anything for us so we will have to manually copy and paste the copy and paste these things in the dns record so you can watch that video as well if you want and once you have completed it you can go to the smtp plugin if you are using and you can click on refresh and here let's click on send email again and here you can see now there is no error and we can also go to this demarkian.com slash demark inspector and here we can here we can write our domain name to check if it's done or not so sometimes there is an error as well so we will have to fix that by contacting the hosting spot so we can click on inspect the domain and you can see it says whether your domain record is valid so it is done if you face any issue do let me know in the comment and like this video subscribe to my channel for more related videos